Hey Cancer, welcome to my channel. This is a monthly love and general tarot reading session for you, Cancer. I hope you are well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good, okay? This reading for today is for the Cancer friends out there. What can I get for Cancer, please? What is the love message and general situationship message that is meant for you to know, ready for you to know? This is for you, Cancer, all right? Thank you for coming back. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for being here today. Guest viewers, if you haven't, click the subscribe button and the bell. Please do it now if you're interested and if you are keen. And if you would like to further connect with my channel, I invite you to follow me on my Instagram account. Connect with me there, please. Check out the website. It has the merchandise and the private reading, extended reading. Also, our merchandise is available via Etsy. All of the links and information, it's down the description box below. If you're interested with new moon, full moon, and the highlight of the astrology um, for this month, check it out, guys. It's in our website or go to the description box below. The link is there. Okay, so let's start your reading. This is a monthly reading for you, okay? So your first reading is you've got the Emperor card in reverse, the Temperance card. <clears throat> The Nine of Swords and the Knight of Pentacles. I feel like you're dealing with... <clears throat> I feel like this month, there is a male, okay? There is a male who you struggle to connect with them or you struggle to understand them or I think for some of you, vice versa. Um, you struggle to connect with one another. I feel like it's related to work. Um <clears throat> Or it could be a personal relationship. It could be an uncle. It could be a father. It could also be a lover for some of you. You know, if if this month, you know, it's a struggle. Temperance card, the emperor card. If, I feel like you will have this, you know, if you, you will have this moment. A moment. You will have this moment this month where you are like a wake-up call, like some sort of, a wake up call, some sort of epiphany. You will, you're just sitting, you're sitting, and then there is like a light bulb idea that hey, I've been struggling towards this person or situation. It's time for me to move on. You'll get up, you'll submit your CB, or you will do something. Okay, like it's like it's a. I don't think it's impulsive. Like it's it's a. A sudden spark will happen to you this month. Like an aha moment where I need to do something. This is enough. I want to be happy. I want to be free. I want to be free from this person. From this complication. And within two weeks of looking for a job. You will get an offer. You know. For some of you. You've been like battling the situation. It's been a pain. It's been a struggle. It's it's always caused you this low vibe energy. Something will tell you, go for it. Whatever that idea that will come along, a spark, a sudden magic. It's it's like magic. It will happen. And you would just do it. Maybe submit a, submit a CV. Do something. Like you feel like this is the answer to be totally, to get rid of this. Like to finally exit this complication or low vibe energy. This is what I need to do. And you did it. After two weeks. There's going to be a result. A knight of pentacles. Best offer. Best moment. A job. Like the universe will answer your reply. There is an answer. Here is an answer to your reply. A knight of pentacles. You know, it's it's like a whirlwind romance for some of you. Like, okay, I don't want you anymore. I go on an online dating and... There you go. After two weeks, you're smiling. You're happy because you've got someone, you know. So there's going to be a spur, spur of the moment. Something magical will happen. Something of a, a sudden idea, a spark of energy. Like it feels electrifying. You would just do it. And after two weeks, two to three weeks, you've got this amazing night of pentacles. So hot, so juicy, so yummy, so rich so good yeah so good okay so listen to your intuition listen to your guide listen to yourself there would be a moment that you will feel just doing it and you will be amazed of the result okay that's the first reading okay that looks so good 
Okay, second reading is King of Wands. And the story continues. Okay. So, you will get this. An offer. Okay? You'll be the King of Wands. You feel so powerful. Like, oh my God. I wish I could have done that earlier. You know? I wish I could have done that earlier. You know, why did I not do it earlier? Something like that. But that's okay because when you have the knight of pentacles activated when you have when you have this coming to you king of wands you feel alive you feel reborn yes you feel reborn you feel so reborn like you feel like there's a whole new world that you have uncovered you've got the eight of pentacles and you get the four of pentacles and the wheel of fortune. So for some of you, this is the... So after you resign or after you convey that, oh, I don't want this anymore. I don't want to be. Once you tell this person, once you exit or tell this person in their face about you having a new job, having a new partner, having a new business, having something outside of them. Um, for some of you guys, you might find it a little bit of a struggle they'll make it difficult in short yeah they will make it a little bit difficult for you if it's a boss if it's a manager they'll give you more work you know they will not be cooperative of you if this is a lover they will not allow you to move on especially if it's like a ex-husband or ex-wife they will make it a little bit complicated for you but i don't think you will be so so affected with that because you're so looking forward with this you have tasted something great and you want to continue it. Like you went out of your comfort zone and it feels so good and brand new and exciting. That is the feeling I'm getting for you in here because this is your king of wands. You're not paying attention. You're so focused with the knight of pentacles because you feel like this is the world. This is the person. This is where I want to belong. Yeah. Some, something amazing. Like, you know, something, like, there's something in here that tells me that it's been a long time that you've been sitting in a sad energy or a stuck energy. This is something new. This is something great. And I think you will fight for this. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Ace of Pentacles, Nine of Wands. For some of you, yeah, I feel like for some of you right away. For those who has business or work or money or financial involvement with this person, you know, they'll tell you, if you leave me or if you leave the, leave the company, you won't get this. It's something that you won't get. And nine of wands, you're like, I don't care. All I want is my, my life to be out of you, out of this. Like, you really want to get out of this, something like that. Like, you really want to, you want to, you're... There's something sparkly, sparkling that you feel. Whenever you feel like, okay, I'm going to get out of this. I'm going to have a new love. I'm going to get something exciting outside of this. It just makes you, it just makes you want more, more to get out. Um, yeah, because the plan is great. Look at the three of wands, king of cups. For some of you guys, you will finally meet the love of your life. You know, three of wands. The king of cups for some of you you will get that dream job you will be able to work with amazing people kind people supportive people in your next job in that next business venture in that next step that you will do outside of this person you will meet amazing people amazing energy it's you know three of wands king of cups it's like it this is just so worth it whatever taking a risk that you will do going outside thinking outside of the box this is just so worth it like you feel a whole new experience it's gonna come alive like you just dream of this you know like the feeling to start and to have this and to feel it it's just makes you feel young it makes you want to like you feel like you want to live more because of this new experience or new happening okay so I hope you really get to activate this energy. I feel like it's an aha moment. Like, you know, listen, to, maybe you're praying, maybe you're meditating, but it will come in, in a day where you're so silent and your intuition, your guide will just tell you, do this. And you follow your intuition and ooh la la, the result is so great. 
okay? So listen to your guide, listen to your intuition, and look after your energy, okay? Don't ever give up on your dream. Don't ever give up on yourself because what's waiting for you is something amazing, okay? You just really have to take that baby step. Think out of your comfort zone. Do something out of the box, okay? It's it, That's the clue to activate this. So I'll see you soon. This is Cyrene reading and have a great day. Bye-bye.